Hello everybody, welcome to game number 7 in the Crendorian League. Uh, 4 2 0 is alright. Uh, but you know, dwarves can't win every game with dwarves. Palmer, 3 guard, edge 4 and a block. 12 men. Up against Killman, who's won 3, lost 3. Got a Palmer, a couple of mighty blow, a troll with mighty blow, 2 guards. So this is horrible, really horrible matchup. He's got 3 more mighty blows and only 1 less guard. But he's got like 5 more strength, 6 more strength, so. It's going to be rough. Going to be a rough match. A draw at best, probably. I would think. A rough like the sandpaper dildo, exactly. Pretty fucking rough. Very rough. Exceedingly rough. I mean, unless I dice fuck out of him, of course, which could happen. But even if, even if he plays shit, which I, I don't know if he's good or bad, or if he's feeling good or feeling bad, uh, you know, I've had obviously had good days and bad days, so if he plays terrible, it doesn't mean he is terrible. But if he plays terrible, um, it's not even going to matter, is it? Because it doesn't matter how you play, you, your strength is your strength. And your guards guard and your mighty balls mighty ball. That's what's crap about bash teams really, isn't it? Should have should have used Dark Elves. <laughs> but being a dirty fun haver, I went with dwarves. Right, let's go for the surf. He goes here, one, two, three, four, five. He blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then someone, uh, the second runner, comes in here to make the push square. Oh, he's got to go there, hasn't he? And then he goes there, and then we blitz in here. He goes in there, he goes one, two, three, four, push to there, push to there, and then, oh, he'll be stood there anyway, so I don't actually have to put anybody there, because he'll be stood here, so I won't be able to surf him anyway, will he? And he'll surf him, right, what goes on here? Fuck knows. Need two D's him. I need one D's him. <laughs> then he uphills him. Oh god, this is looking fun, isn't it? Right, so he just goes there. Ah, well, that means he can be free. So he goes he goes here. Guard goes in there. One, one, two. One, two, three, four. And then he stood there. So he's pretty safe from getting served. Well, no, he's not because he could blitz from here, couldn't he? So he will have to go there to stop that. Right. Hello. It's a blitz. Opponent sets up his guy to get surfed, and gets a blitz. Blood ball, how I miss thee. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, God. Why even? Maybe that won't be back on that. That's kind of what it is. I don't find it funny or anything, it's just like a fucking waste of time. So my armor it gets pond instead of me surfing his pond. <laughs> it doesn't even fall. <laughs> Puts him back surfable again. <laughs> no, no, he's not gonna. So he can block him. Oh shit, yeah, he's there. Fuck. Or he can blitz him. an uphill isn't it? Eat after one day. Eat in one day. There you go. Easy as you like. Eat in maybe two day. Full turn, wasn't it? I mean, I had to make the one days with being outstrength massively and being bloodstone.
Ces joueurs sont tout proches. Le combat paraît inévitable. <sighs> Just want to repaint my cars in GTA. <laughs> It takes ten years, doesn't it, playing Blood Bowl? That's the that's the bad thing. Your opponent takes a fucking minute to stand up a couple of guys. Makes me fucking lose the will to live. Honestly, it's fucking bad when I feel like this. This is the this is the killer Blood Bowl. I feel alright, it's alright. Super, another random AV break. Doesn't need a dot, doesn't even need all these points. Greed it. I'm pretty sure the fact that he made that pause at first, he was like, but why isn't it a knockdown? No, he didn't. He did not reroll it. I thought for sure to reroll it. I thought that pause was like, you know, the pause of, why isn't it a knockdown? <laughs> What's going on? Oh wow, this is a nice little surf, isn't it? Nice of him to get surfed like that. I mean, I'll probably just pow him instantly. But, you know. I want to follow. It doesn't matter for power, does it? Oh, you thought power, yeah. So, because I want to follow, I want to make this block first while I still got the guard there. Hmm. I think we'll have to blitz with him just because. Uh, Otherwise, it's going to be hard to protect the ball. Yep, there you go, there's the pal. Classic. <laughs> and now I've wasted a blitz as well. soon, eh? Fair play to this guy. Fucking that's dedicated, I need getting them put, but I don't know what time. I don't know what time he is. PDT, I think. Three AM <laughs> He's got up at 3am to play this game, Jesus. <laughs> what a madass! <laughs> That's fucking dedication, that, innit? <laughs> Christ. That's outrageous. Ah. That'll be nice for him if he wins then, won't it? Oh, 
I'll let him win, that's fair. That's fair, getting up at 3am deserves to win. <laughs> How's that sound? GFI here first. Safe moves first with a GFI. Classic. Pom this shithead. <laughs> Absolutely fucked him right up. Oh, did actually. Did actually fuck him right up. Glorious. Who would have believed it? Hey, silky smooth long beard there. One, so he's got a dodge with him. You'd have to power him, power him, and there's still a screen. So, he can 2D him as well. Now he can one day him, and then he could one day him. Can re-roll this as well. Oh no, so now I want to push him away to there. So that means I do want to do this. I won't re-roll this, but if I sandwich him, it stops him running around and hit the ball, doesn't it? Glorious. Oh, baby. And the skull here is fine because he can't dodge through anyway. Not even a skull. Get out of town, you clown. What a glorious... What a glorious turn that was! A Kaz under screen. Good dice. That's why they call me Good Dice Jim. Three GFIs, that was the most surprising part of the turn. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, they don't wear coal. But it's like, funny enough being called coal, much like in the double double E when, uh, it's like the double double E when, uh, what's he called? JBL says, uh, Says that's why they call him Big Game John. <laughs> like, no one calls him Big Game John. <laughs> Big Match John, even. <laughs> that's why they call him Big Match John. No, they don't. No one calls him Big Match John. <laughs> yeah, the serve didn't go well, did it? Both serves, yeah. <laughs> one serve was a blitz, and the other one was a pal. Flip me. Flip flipping me. Mm. 
But, you know, so this game has been good dice, to be fair, apart from the Blitz. Um, his pawn hasn't broken AV, I don't think, yet. He's made a couple of stuns with Rando Blackhawks, but... Now it's only been a couple of turns. <laughs> so, oh, he's had three though with the Blitz. <laughs> so there is that. Oh dear. Il a plongé comme un abruti de saumon. Il faut viser les yeux quand on tente ce coup là, Jim. Right, so obviously I want to blitz with a palm, but he's in a not great spot. have guard so I'm gonna have to power him with one assist We'll roll a skull instead, that seems good. Double one. Le double one there, wasn't it? One on the darkness, then a skull on the block. Didn't make fun of the French. It's just how they literally all speak. <laughs> I was just quoting every every Frenchman who's ever spoke a sentence. <laughs> no mocking. <laughs> Hey, he stacked him up as well. Hit to do the GFIs. Hit to. <laughs> oh no, I failed him. <laughs> We're going to see a prime fucking baked potato. about to be served right up. Jesus fuck, imagine being able to knock someone over ever. He wants to, guard goes wants to go in there so he can blitz him. But then guard also wants to go in there so he can block him and then he can block him. So one, two, three, four, five, that's a better place really, but a GFI. There's no, so the blitz actually has to go on him because there's no way through. So the bit has to come on him. And let's push him again. 
that's what I really like to do. Uh, I think, you know, pe people people like to you know act clever and say that you should knock players over, but uh, they're just fucking showboating, really, aren't they? The real skill comes in only ever rolling pushes, and uh, and you can be proud of yourself. Right, smash his fucking Mr. Throw in. Fucking right up. And then let's go for the Frenzy Trap. Nope. Not today. Little trolley boy. Little trolley boy. Wee wee wee. Zemba zemba Monge too. I wanted to make a break for it, but that fucker survived six dice. <laughs> six dice on this cunt. Otherwise, <laughs> I would have knocked him down and would have been up that way and in the clear. First action blitz with a pom and pom. Fantastic. Blitz with a pom and pile on. At least he's got his priorities right. Oh, he can base the ball here. Will he double GFI? He's got to be tempted. He isn't going to GFI. Really stupid has really fucked him there, hasn't it? Because he gets. Uh, I've pissed on his Weetabix. Yeah, oop. Oop. Come on, Why is not even moving that guy? Now when we only needed a push to deal with him, of course, now comes the power. Not that I'm complaining about a power, you understand. This is tough because uh, the best thing to do, well, the safest play is to hit block with him, right? So there's no frenzy trap. Le cas magique. Oui, oui, oui. We are made the cas. The greed is rewarded. Mange tout. Uh, it's to do with the logo, Targaryen Tantrum. It's to do with the logos. The uh, logo is the Plim Plum Blue. And uh, the Plim Plum Blue. Oh no! We have failed the. Uh, we have failed the Go for It. 
as he go for it. He can uh, blitz this guy, so we probably want to stand him up so he does not blitz this guy. Here we go for the 1D. <laughs> the one dice removal, classic dwarf. It was worth doing the GFI there because otherwise it was too easy on it. Three plus one, two, three, GFI, GFI. Three, two, two to hit the ball was too easy. One, two, three, four, five. He's got it that way, but then it'd be uphill, wouldn't it? So. Oh, noise movement seven. Oh, fuck. Cock shit balls. One, two, three, four, GFI, GFI. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I should have put the ball, like, here or something, then. Or here, even. Oh, shit. Oh, and that's not a screen. Ah, oh, but this is a screen. So he's got a 1D on the ball. An easy 1D on the ball. Shit. That was dumb, wasn't it? Pay attention to see if your opponent has move-ups. That's a pro tip for you there. Oh, thanks, Alice. <laughs> That's a rather callous comment. That's probably a th play where if I was worse, I wouldn't have made it because I would have counted the squares out, but I just was like, ah, oh, but he can't reach. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I didn't mean it was it was bad, it's just because Callus rhymes with Alice. <laughs> no, thanks. I appreciate trying to keep it like that. 3-2-2-4. So it's still not easy, even with a reroll. Hey, reroll gone. <laughs> Plim plom plu. Glorious. Right, so he can reach us wherever we go. Now he can really easily reach us. One, two, three, four, five, six, G, five, G, five. No, he can't. <sighs> Want to hit the pond, don't I? takes him away from the uh, troll for what it's worth which isn't much but the main thing is just pomming his pommel isn't it upskirt there good old cyanide in their upskirts they love it maybe I should have piled on there oh he was there fuck I didn't need to do that oh that was dumb maybe I should have piled on there He have to do the GFIs. No, he's definitely not fucking doing anything with this bastard. Oh, look, the next two dice were a fucking ten. But Paul and Arda cast him. But he, he's one in four to stay out, isn't he, for the second half? Whereas with Pile on, he's only a one in six to stay out for the rest of the match. If I'd had the 9+, plus, I would have 
done it. Like if I had if I had mighty blow on the armor and the injury, I would have quite gone. But I guess there's still a chance of just KOing him again. I don't know, it might have been better to pile on. I guess someone could do the maths and work out if it was better to pile on. Plus I wouldn't have got hit by the troll, but then on the other hand... ...he fell on him. Yes, I know I'm not. Oh god, he even went the wrong way. <laughs> and rolled the pal. <laughs> oh my god. He went completely the wrong way and rolled the pal. Oh god. <laughs> he went the auto pathway. <laughs> Still got the pal. <laughs> oh god. Oh, flip me, guys. Flip flipping me. Obviously, first thing to do is punch the troll. With Tom. He can blitz. One, two, three, four, yeah. I guess do this first, in case it's a dub skull. Kill my players. It's more likely to kill my players. I know he's got regen, but he's more likely to kill my players, isn't he, with mighty blow? Add more strength. We're all about the pixel hugging. Wouldn't be dwarves if you didn't want to pixel hug. Touchdown! <laughs> the knockouts, they come back. Oui, oui, oui. It is weird, yeah. It's this logo. Better player than my... Uh... <laughs> the my rebel game right now. <laughs> yeah, <clears> there <throat> wasn't much more I could do, was there? But he played it wrong. It was. It wasn't even that hard. It was a four three four four three two two four. It wasn't crazy. Um. Oh, he's got. Is, no, he hasn't got a goblin. Eighth this Thursday. No. Did he use his? Did he use his apple? That's me. You know, he used his apple on one of the cars. <laughs> yeah, the offset logos. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's really pro, isn't it? I mean, imagine your job is a computer programmer. Whatever the fuck they call them. Coder for computer games. or An actual professional company. And you, you've got one job. <laughs> and it's to put a logo on a pitch. <laughs> now every, everybody in the world would centre that logo on this square, wouldn't they? But not this guy. He thinks I'll deliberately place it offset by an eighth of a square. Or he's just fucking incapable. One of the two. Imagine getting paid actual money to do that. <laughs> like a proper job. <laughs> not not on that Fiverr website. An actual real professional job. That's what I'm going to do with a logo. Fucking hell. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> I 
And it's down as well. It's not even just off. It's down as well, isn't it? It's down in the corner as well. Fucking hell. This <laughs> is just... <laughs> Maybe it's the maybe it's to do with the lines, but there's lines all around, so that doesn't make much sense, does it? It's fucking awful, isn't it? This is offset as well in in the square as well. And it's just randomly halfway across these squares. Fucking awful. I guess that's okay because it's randomly halfway across. No, that's that's okay because for some reason you want this and this, but why is it not in the middle? <laughs> it even makes, it even puts, it even totally fucked up. Look how close that is to the T, and then that's closer to the T than the N, and then that's closer to the N. <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> maybe the grid's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe the square is smaller. <laughs> maybe the square is smaller than the square. Ah! Well, it is because of the line on the pitch, so maybe it is the lines on the pitch. But then surely they'll be the same either side. <laughs> Looking terrible. Missing a guard is nice, isn't it? Put the uh, sit out the edge for guy. On D. Defense. Defense and the offense. Bit of speed on either side. I guess he's better than him, so put these around so there's a better player that side. He's down at 10 now, isn't he? That's really terrible, isn't it? I mean, that is really terrible. I would sack that guy if I was in charge. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Francois Dugary. <laughs> I would sack you. <laughs> if you can't put a log in the middle of the pitch. <laughs> Get the fuck out. Hit by the rock, but not dead. What's going on? Good dice, Jim. <laughs> he should have thought about them. He should have thought about them, Webcall. You can't hold me responsible. He should have. He should have thought about them. And he. <laughs> he should have. Uh, <laughs> when he was. When he was making the. When he was centering logos and on the pitch. Doing a half-assed job. He should have thought about his beautiful wife Marie <laughs> and that that sick baby who <laughs> is now going to die <laughs> because they can't afford the meds. Well, do I give a shit? No. I mean, it, it's noticeable with all of the logos, isn't it? You know, even the ones that don't have a square around them. It's noticeably off. But, uh, yeah, that the square makes it even more noticeable. You can see exactly how far off it is, can't you? Continue to fail to break AV, please. Good. <laughs> He's 
It's going pretty well on the damage front. I mean, shouldn't lose this game now. Yeah. Yeah, they can't really have it on games though, can they? Because um, you can do it on you can do it on Blood Bowl in a closed league, on Blood Bowl two in a closed league, you can. But it's the copyright thing is a thing, isn't it? I think that's why they don't do it with real games. That's why they have all their half assed shit like the Rockstar logo editor and the uh, For Honor fucking crappy little editor and stuff. They generally don't let you just put the pictures in. I guess it could be porn as well, couldn't it? Rather than just copyright. I just thought of copyrighted things, but I guess. Fumble checks everything, doesn't it? Just short of it. No, not with him. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI. Bob's your uncle. Fanny's your aunt. So I can 1D the ball. 2-2 two, two, to 1D the ball. Am I going to go for a complex strategy now? Hello, Machina. Not great. <laughs> Still alive. Whether that's a good thing or not, undecided. Herp derp, base, 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 this won't fail, I'm on the right. Herp, herp, herp. This is the, uh, as nuanced and tactical as a game can be. Ha ha ha! There is my 1D on the ball! Take that! You little prick! <laughs> oh god! <laughs> That's amazing! Yeah, I know you can upload your face with the uh... You've been able to do that. Jesus Christ, they are fucked up faces. To think there's people that actually look like that. <laughs> Poor bastards. <laughs> That's why they call me Good Dash, Jim. <laughs> Stack Stack'em up. You have to do the GFIs. You have to. At least that's lulled him into potatoing. So it wasn't too terrible. Well, I just put the guy in the wrong place there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, back door, Billy. He's got to leave his head on the ball here. How's he going to cover this guy? It's got to be a 2D on the ball here. Got to be. There's got to be. Whoa, that was a huge, huge activation, wasn't it? If he'd gone stupid there. 
That would have been monumental. Right, we just need to fill in this square and then can block him and pow him to there. How do you fill in this square? Not easily. Maybe free up him? Maybe free up him. Push him into there. Shit. Could have taken the push bench to three plus for a one D, isn't it? Ah, oh, this works, doesn't it? Yes, I'm so good at Blood Bowl. Oh, I'm so good at Blood Bowl! Yes, I got the pushes! Get in! Get in! Got the pushes. GG. Maybe that really wasn't worth making it. Two dice on the ball, was it? <laughs> Fuck's sake. I probably shouldn't have gone. When I didn't get the knockdown on, on that guy making it a frenzy trap, I probably shouldn't have gone for it. And requiring the GFI. I probably should have not gone for it then. Yeah, it's unfortunate just a three plus hour, isn't it? Well, not unfortunately, it just is. <laughs> Lucky you've passed the wand. And... Major potato play. Stacked them up. He stacked them up. And it starts with a dodge. He stacked two GFIs after the dodge. <laughs> Easy. Hello, Pedro. Oh, that's a lot of bollocks in it. <laughs> he fucking stacked them up. <laughs> Start with a dodge and stack them up. Oh, dear me. He's got a score next turn anyway, hasn't he? End at date. 15 chance here. 15 chance for a 2-1 grind, even if the 1D on the ball fails. Ce 
yeah. All the of four in fact. <laughs> Oh, the 1D. Shame I can't chain Blitzer forward. Because I could chain him forward one. Which I'm pretty sure I can't. Block him to there and then fill in these two and then block him and then fill in all these and then chain him to there and then I could serve him. But I don't think that's possible. Um. One, two, three, four. He can go there for the assist. No, cast him. Glorious. scoring next turn. Gives us five to score back with two rerolls. You might use a reroll on the dodge. Maybe I even one in nine. <laughs> Every time, Jelly Pally. <laughs> we both piled on every. Oh no, the one time I didn't was to get an assist. But we both piled on every time. I don't think so, Pedro. I always pile on all the time. I always pile on all the time. It's just fun, isn't it? Two men up though. Two men up. He's done the get surfed set up again. Oh, maybe he's going to change it. He's got nine players, yeah. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, no, it's all right. <laughs> Just making it easier to surf, in fact. Now you've got the one, two, there. Oh, God, that's really lovely, isn't it? 
now we've got the the one two three four and then surfing out that way Yeah, I really want to see it work as well. <laughs> it fucking should, shouldn't it? People shouldn't be able to get away with it. You can't keep getting away with it. Opponent tries to lose twice. Gets blitz both times. Ah! <laughs> yep, you know, he's already had one, Pedro. That was the funniest thing. He's already done the same thing. He's already done it in this game. He's done it twice. <laughs> twice set up to get himself served. Twice got a blitz. Ah, oh boy. And this time it was ludicrously easy because I didn't even need the guy there to set it up. It was just it was just push to there, push to there, push out. <laughs> Yeah, apparently he can. I was just quoting a movie. I didn't genuinely believe that he couldn't keep getting away with it. Not a movie, it's a TV series. GFI, why not me? Why not adding a GFI for fun? <laughs> and a cast. That seems totally fair. What a good game. What a good game Blood Bowl is. And he gets the ball in a two tackle zones. Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Double skulls. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes. This sure is the game I know and hate. You should see it, shouldn't you, when someone gives it up? I could do, wasn't it? Yeah, it's good being edge four, isn't it? <laughs> I should definitely not try to set to serve people from setup anymore. That's all it does is guarantee a blitz. I did it the last time I played in tabletop, to be honest. 
and uh, it blew the guy's mind. <laughs> and he was like, wow, that's amazing. And I was like, yeah, I'm a streamer, it's kind of my thing. I do these surfs and everyone's like, wow, you're the best. You're the best at surfing. <laughs> the funny thing is, it was, wasn't it? Yeah, I shouldn't have, uh, I shouldn't have selected the dwarves, you were quite right. Uh-oh, uh-oh, it's a frenzy trap. Woe is me! Oof, got the darkness. No misclicks this time, pile the fuck on. For nothing. Get up there! He's in range of him. That's alright. <laughs> and before him, Canal. And after him, Sage. Oh, Space Cadet! Le Space Cadet? Mon petit pois, ha ha ha, oui oui oui. Thank you very much. Have I done a blitz yet? I have not done the blitz yet. Welcome, yes, welcome, Space Cadet 404 viewers. Um, as you can see, I've got the ball here. Um, <laughs> and what I'm going to do now is something you've never seen before if you're dedicated, uh, if you're dedicated viewers of Space Cadet. But I'm going to blow your mind with, uh, rather than relying on an unprotected ball carrier and saying, of course it's a pal, when he inevitably gets two diced, uh, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to move my players in a formation that we call a screen. And what this means is, now it's very, very difficult indeed for him to hit the ball. Um, <laughs> it's a weird, it's a weird <laughs> fucking play, I know. <laughs> it might... It might fucking blow your mind, but there you go. <laughs> we are going to do a 1D. <laughs> and another 1D. <laughs> and another 1D. So we've got, you know, we've got this. <laughs> we've got a bit of it. There you go. We've got a bit of space cadetry for you. <laughs> hello, space cadet. And hello, viewers. Thank you very much for the host. Raid, whatever. Raid, is it? Thank you very much on a, on a serious note. <laughs> I could be serious for a minute. Thank you. <laughs> Protecting the ball. Absolute heresy. That's heresy, pure and simple. Which is very obscure reference, there you go. Heresy, pure and simple. You might be able to get that if you're, uh, if you're probably British and of a certain age and a certain taste in music. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have protected the ball there. I know, and in fact, the attacker was down. Unbelievable, Jeff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true, Roshan begins, yeah. That's true. I, I got the winch this game because my opponent made a screen out of nothing. <laughs> he, he, he relied on auto-passing. <laughs> there was a player like here, so he could have he could have um he could have made a four plus three plus. But instead, there was a player here. Uh, where was there? Was there was a player here or something? So he could have gone four three, but instead he went four four three and just threw an extra four for no reason because he he did auto pathing. <laughs> still worked. Still got the one D. Still got the one D, pal. Standard. A bit tricky. This is a bit tricky. Mm. 
I think you just don't care about him. And focus on disguised toast. If he goes to there, he won't be able to punch. He won't be able to punch either because of the screen. Look at this madness. No justice. This is pretty good, isn't it? I think this is pretty pretty safe, as safe as it's going to get. I mean, it does mean he can blitz him and squeeze us on the sideline. Which isn't ideal. But can try a dodge without a reroll. Stop that. Of course it fails. Hello, Jelly Deals. Yes, an AV break on that all could have been. And he is going to go for the pointless GFI <laughs> with, a, with a loner. <laughs> uh, no, it was the right spot, I thought. You're entitled to see an irrelevant GFI. So there is that. And he has jammed us in, of course. Mr. Throw. Absolutely. Right, we've got an uphill. He really likes GFIs, yeah. <laughs> he loves the GFIs. There you go, Space Cadet. See, he knew. He knew. He knew what was up. Do we go for the 1D POW here? Because if the Troll Slayer hits, obviously that's more sensible. But what does this guy even do? 1, 2, 3, 4, GFI or like what? Whereas if he does a 1D and POWs, then the Troll Slayer can go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, double GFI, smash. Ah. Uh, which is good, isn't it? Yeah, it's freed up everybody. Now this is not a 1D, now it's a 2D. <laughs> yeah, it's not a car. Oh yeah, Mark the scoring threat. Jelly with a good Blood Bowl tips. Jelly or the actual actually playing blood ball ideas. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I think I just got uphill blitz. Sweet. Sweet cheeks. <laughs> true, true Pedro. Alright, it's stack him up, seems it works for him. Hey! Space Cadets, the channel for that, Pedro. Oh, yeah. Hello, Necro in fitness. Going pretty well. 2 0 up, won the game. The magic. <laughs> Lucky cunt, thanks, buddy. <laughs> Zero SPP goes on the Alouettes. 
Right, it doesn't matter, does it? Oh no, 2-1, I thought it was 2-0. <laughs> oh yeah, shit, a riot wouldn't be good. That's why I set up like this in case of a riot. See, clever. Not because I didn't realise he only had one turn. Um, it was in case of a riot. Clever. I honestly thought it was 2-0 and I just said all our laziness. <laughs> and genuinely thought it was 2-0. I just couldn't be bothered to set up properly. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, rogue shenanigans. If you want to be part of Team Positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop bitching like a little baby. I do not endorse the, 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 what, my, what, the what my viewers write in chat. <laughs> Even though I may find it amusing. <laughs> Maybe. Nobody knows. <laughs> it's not true. <laughs> not true. It was a high kick. It wasn't a right. Oh, God. Right. GG. Oh no, you say you shouldn't write GG to your opponent if you've won. I've heard. I've heard that's a... That's a thing. <laughs> Get fucked! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna go for that how how I get fucked option. I wanna write GG. Cause it was pretty close, wasn't it? He put some pressure on there. Get Could fucked, you there, little man. cunt! <laughs> I mean, okay, I got yeah, you know, and he got he got a couple of chances to sack the ball, I got a couple of chances to sack the ball. It was, I thought it was a good game. <laughs> New Christmas card. Von Hilda! Von Hilda! I am stuck under the bench! <laughs> You know that new Christmas cards. <laughs> I wrote it on a guy's leaving card from school. I wrote, try showing this to your mum now, you fucking penis or something like that. <laughs> it, was from, it was from the A to Z of behaving badly. <laughs> and it was like, on a, you should write it in a leaving from work thing. <laughs> I wrote that. Uh, I was quite proud of myself at the time. And then I thought, what a dickhead. And I was, you know, when I look back on it, <laughs> oh god, the old neuroscientist. What a laugh. Gotta go for the pond smash, haven't I? Scientists. Well, he's not even neuroscientist, he's a teacher. <laughs> GG. Now let me stamp on your face. Well, I thought it was a G. Good G. I thought it was a GG. You just realised that, well done, Jelly. <laughs> what did you think I was saying? Just <laughs> he did get two blitzers, yeah, yeah, he did get two blitzers. That's true. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh God, Rogue Shanigans, stop it. Longbeard got a level up. That's nice, isn't it? He got up at three a.m. to play this game. Hats off. Hats off to. Uh, Kill Bill, whatever he's called. He got about 3 a.m. his time to play that game. <laughs> yeah. If Sage, if Sage was a was an octopus, that's what he'd say. All right, guard. Let's be imaginative and go with guard there. So there you go, that's another guard. 
More guard for the guard god. Kamyuk. Oh, it's a completion away. That's nice, isn't it? Can go for a cheeky completion. And uh, completion in the tuddy for him. Tuddy for him. Tuddy for these guys. All, all Kazas, of course. Tuddy for him. I don't really want more skills than him, though. He's just a reserve, isn't he? Um, 5 2 0. Not bad. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.